Hello friends, this is Abhishek. Uh, today we're gonna talk about the status bar plugin. Uh, uh, if you notice, uh, when iOS 7 was released, uh, they have they have uh, changed the status bar uh, for the uh, newest iOS 7 applications, right? So if you handle the status bar according to your application, then you can manage by this plugin. Okay, for that, uh, you have to add a plugin called uh, status bar okay oaj.apache.co.status bar and after that you will get some uh, different different methods uh, from which you can manage the uh, status bar so here uh, i'm gonna show you um, all the steps okay you can also manage via the uh, plugin con uh, sorry preferences like a config.xml file by uh, setting the values for the overlay or uh, by the background color or the bar style right or you can also manage it by the methods like uh, overlay web view by setting the um, show hide method show defaults like etc etc here i have uh, listed some important points first of all I am just closing everything and uh, in my config.xml if I notice I am getting a two points that is uh, uh, one for a status bar overlay web view true or status bar style light content suppose I am setting the status bar overlay by default I am running this and I am getting the overlay like this okay that means your application will start from 00, zero pointer not from uh, the like this not like this okay and uh, if we set to the overlay false then uh, your header become different compared to your application okay uh, your application will start from the uh, after the status bar okay and after that uh, if you want to set the style then uh, you have to you can set your whatever your color you want like just by using the background color name like this if your application is uh, using the most of using the red color then you can uh, configure uh, the status bar color like this or uh, if you want to set uh, the sorry uh, bar style like light, light content or everything or you can also set it by uh, setting the parameters appropriate parameters okay all the all the parameters you will get from uh, this plugin like here okay black supported color names okay and uh, okay these are the style back transparent okay uh, you can also set this style uh, black translate or light uh, whatever you like okay and uh, one more important point that I would like to show you that is if I set to set as well as hide then I'm not getting any status bar in my application okay like a game application if I want to develop a game application in PhoneGap then this plugin will help you because in a game application you do not need any uh, status bar uh, on this screen okay and if you want to show then just click on show that will show the status bar by default it shows so you do not need to show the uh, plugins okay or you can also set whatever you, that you want okay according to color you have to match up that right uh, i hope you guys have enjoyed this uh, uh, different uh, font gap plugins uh, and uh, i hope uh, this plugin will help you to uh, help you to manage your application okay 
and uh, one more thing I would like to show you that uh, in uh, our last video tutorial that is uh, related to the network information okay in which you do not need uh, the last video is working properly just disconnect your network uh, the application automatically get prompted that uh, the uh, offline event has been fired or uh, whatever you have configured in uh, offline mode right so uh, just uh, and more one more thing that I would like to tell you that uh, uh, just use original device don't use the uh, emulator for uh, using the plugin uh, like the network status after that vibrations after that uh, uh, you can say uh, the status bar after that the battery status camera for motions okay for the device information for that uh, media or media capture you have you need a device uh, on which you can get all these events properly so you can configure or you can uh, test your application properly okay uh, in my next video tutorial we're gonna uh, see some more uh, plugins for the phone gap till then uh, bye bye don't uh, forget to subscribe my channel for the next video tutorial notifications thank you for watching bye bye